Seven A Santa Barbara Catholic School production. The boy who leapt to Rhoda. Long ago, there existed a time when strength and power were the measure of a man. On Guam, a man named Masala was the strongest. He could complete any task asked of him, and many looked at him in awe of his power and might. In time, his wife bore him a son. Masala could not be happier. He was filled with pride. He showed the baby off to everyone he knew. As the boy grew older, he became more and more like his father. He grew strong enough to overpower every other boy in the village. It was because of this that he received more and more attention for his strength and power, and soon he became more powerful than his father. This made Masala very envious and angry with his son. One day, at the tender age of two, Masala's son caught a coconut crab and spent many hours playing with it. He thoroughly enjoyed playing with the crab. But when he became momentarily distracted, the crab disappeared into a hole near a coconut tree. The child reached down into the hole and tried to get his pet, but he was unable to reach it. As his father watched, the child pulled the coconut tree near the hole completely out of the ground. Seeing this, Masala boiled over with envy. Before realizing what he was doing, he began chasing his son, yelling at him in a jealous rage. The boy was shocked at his father's behavior because he was so used to his father being very proud of him. The boy could not have known that his father would become his greatest enemy. The son sprang up and ran to the northern tip of the island as fast as his little legs could carry him. He took one great leap off the cliff and landed in Rota, forty miles away. To this day, the footprint of the child Puntin Podgun can still be seen on the northern tip of Guam. The end.